The Blue Jays really shook up their roster yesterday, and here's the reason why. The Blue Jays made a total of six roster moves in one day yesterday with pitchers and position players alike. And the most interesting one to me has to be the fact that Ernie Clement is coming up for Otto Lopez in the big leagues. Now, if you've been following the Blue Jays for a while, you know that Otto Lopez has been flirting with the idea of becoming a major league bench player for quite some time right now. And with the injury to Santiago Espinal, it seemed like this could be a good opportunity for Otto Lopez. And just as quickly as he got called up, he got sent down and replaced by Ernie Clement, who joined the Blue Jays this past winter. But the real reason why behind Otto Lopez getting sent down was just the fact that he has not been producing in AAA really at all with the bat. So far this year, he's only produced a 533 OPS, which is not really good for a Blue Jays lineup before yesterday's big game, was struggling offensively. So if someone's going to come up and get the amount of playing time that Santiago Espinal had, you at least want them to be a little bit good with the bat. And so far at AAA, Ernie Clement, he's got an OPS of 921. And as well, he can play a lot of the infield positions like second, shortstop, and third base. And to top it all off, last night he actually got his first hit with the Blue Jays, so congratulations, Ernie. Let's see what else you got in that bat. And the next move, Adam Simber. He's back with the team after being reinstated from the 15-day IL, and Thomas Hatch has been sent back down to AAA. This is positive for the Blue Jays as you get back a quality middle relief arm in Adam Simber. So far, Adam Simber this year has a whip of 409 and a whip of 1.273, and this man is a innings eater. He comes out all the time in the middle inning, to bridge us over to the back end bullpen guys it's great to have you back adam but speaking of the il some other interesting news is that mitch white has been placed on the 60 day il if you were following in spring training mitch white had some setbacks and he had to go and do some rehab assignments down in triple a buffalo and it has not looked good for mitch white at all in his rehab starts he had a 6.88 era with a whip of 1.824 yikes now a big decision was coming for mitch white and his future with the toronto blue jays his rehab have assignment was coming to an end which means he had to be added to the 26 man roster or he would have to get designated for assignment and i think the blue jays didn't want to add a struggling mitch white who maybe didn't feel 100 percent healthy coming back to a major league team so what they've done is they've added him to the 60 day il which has given him an additional 30 games for his rehab assignment let mitch white recover a bit more and let him get back to his peak form and guys those are all your blue jays roster moves from yesterday it was a ton but i hope that this kind of explains it all Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to this Blue Jays channel. And as always, guys, go Jays go.